Chevron, gagawa tayo ngayon nitong Italian Carnival Fritters. In Italian, fritelle. Instant donuts. Ready in 5 minutes. So let's get started. Bago tayo gumawa ng butter, simulan na natin initin ng oil over medium heat. I'm using peanut oil para mas less ang oil absorption. Paghaluin lahat ng liquid ingredients, let's start sa milk, lemon juice, if you want, you can also use orange. Then oil, fresh medium egg, And last, ang vanilla. Gamit ang hand whisk, whisk well until completely combined. Then, set aside. Let's get another bowl and let's sift all the powder ingredients together. Flour, potato starch, and baking powder. Ginagawa natin ito para walang lumps. Oops! Pasensya na! May nagaganap na kamesihan. Then add in the sugar and mix. Kunin natin ang liquid mixture. Then transfer half of the powder ingredients. Gamit ang hand whisk, mix the butter well until you get smooth and lump-free mixture. Pag okay na yan, ilagay ang remaining powder. At this point, ang gagamitin nating pang mix ay fork or wooden fork. Kasi pag hand whisk ang gamit, mahihirapan kayong maghalo. Ayan, okay na. Ganito ang perfect consistency. Ready na tayo magluto. Sa pag-check kung na-reach na ang 160 degrees to 170 degrees Celsius, pwede kayong gumamit ng skewer, wooden spoon, or thermometer. Kunin ng 2 teaspoons. Take the butter using one of the teaspoons. And with the other teaspoon, slide natin ang dough directly into the boiling oil. Cook this for 3 to 4 minutes until golden brown na. But once in a while, check nyo ang apoy and temperature ng oil. If masyadong mainit or mabilis mag-dark ang donuts, ilesen natin ang heat. Pag-drop ng balls sa oil, hindi dapat ito mag stay sa ilalim. But fill up with bubbles and immediately rise to the surface. Don't worry kung hindi siya perfect circle. You may even make irregular shapes or perhaps something fun. It's all up to you. Minsan, kusa siyang nag-flip. But if not, they are going to need a little bit of help with flipping. Kunin ng baking pan with kitchen towel and ilagay dito ang drained fritter balls. Mix nyo ang butter if nagiging thick na ito. Continue cooking until all the butter is consumed. Sigurado akong magugustuhan ito ng mga kiddos ninyo and for sure pwede din nilang gawin ito. But remember to assist them in cooking part. Guys, if you try this recipe, please leave a comment and let me know what you think. And please subscribe and hit that notification bell.
After draining, pwede niyong ilagay ito directly into the bowl of custard sugar to coat them. Or once cool, you may put chocolate on top or sprinkle with powdered sugar. Alam niyo guys, napakalambot pa rin ito even after 3 days. Bon appetito! Tasting time na! So, Itin ko kunin natin yung may sugar. So, okay lang kahit merong mga ganitong nagaganap. Carry lang yan. Para hawakan. May handle tayo, di ba? So, let's taste it. Mm -hmm. Crunchy outside. Super soft inside. So that's it for today guys. I hope you enjoyed this recipe. If you did, please don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. And pakifollow na rin ang aming social media accounts, Facebook and Instagram. Ciao for now. Huwag niyo kalimutan mag-comment.